Now, there's another way of working this. Now, there's a guy that I've developed a fondness for called Al Barga, good old friendly Al, told us we were definitely going to get permits and all kinds of other shit in this town. He's chairman of the youth board. So I just uh, call up the police and say, this is uh, Al Barga, chairman of the youth board. I'd like to know what's happening to our truck down there in Lincoln Park. Yes, sir. You know, and they get you that information right quick. And you can dress that up a little, you know. Say, uh, I spoke to Commander Brash. They can never find these guys. So you can never... The cops, the cops are like the yippies. You can never find the leaders. So you say, I spoke to Commander Brash. And uh, you can check this out with him. And they'll say, oh, yeah. Then they'll give you permission. Because they don't check it out with him. Right? So that's it. You just find the names of top city officials. Now, here's another one. Here's another schmuck. <laughs> I'm giving all this because I got a feeling I'm going to get it tonight anyway. I mean, that's mighty spooky, you know, if you feel somebody's out to get you, you know, and all of a sudden you hear these firecrackers flanging away, you know, that we're throwing here in an attempt to confuse the cops. I mean, we're confusing each other. I ain't telling you to do any of these things. I ain't telling you, no, don't do them. Don't do these things. I mean, only yes, SDS tells you what to do. They come in with a truck and say, come down here, come down here, come down here. Everybody come down here. You know, fuck them. You know, I mean, I saw an SDS college punk, you know, whose father's probably got $10 million, and he's working his way through the revolution by getting degrees, telling a 15-year-old yippie who done hitched his way here from Haight-Ashbury on two bucks, telling him what to do. And that kid just smiled, and he probably got a thing in his back pocket, and he's going to get that SDS kid when the shit hits the fan. And Wednesday night, the shit is really going to hit the fan. And you, you know, like, uh, I think it's a good idea to, like, cut your hair or get a wig or let your hair grow pretty fast or paint your face or change your clothes or get a new hat and get a new name. I mean, everybody ought to have a new name by then. And, like, uh, you know, we're all one huge happy family with all new names or no names. And new faces. Because we bust out of this park and go down to Grand Park and then go out to the amphitheater. They're going to be some mighty strange theatrical events. <laughs> and you better have your theater thing down pretty pat. Theater, guerrilla theater can be used as defense and as offensive weapon. I mean, I think that, like, people could survive naked, see? Yeah. I think you take all your fucking clothes up, a cop won't hit you. You're talking about war. What the fuck has a picket line got to do with war? You see? But people that are into, like, a very literal bag, like a heavy word scene, you know, don't understand the use of communication in this country and the use of media. I mean, they say if they give, give a ten-page speech on it against imperialism, everybody, you know, listens and understands and says, yeah. But you throw fucking money out in the stock exchange, and people get that right away. And that goes, you know, that mess, they say, yeah, right, I understand what that's about. They know what you're doing. If they don't, fuck them. If they don't know what you're doing, fuck them. Who cares? You have a, like, take this. See, you use blank space as information. That's by saying bullshit. You, you would carry a sign that says, and the, right? What's the next word, right? Everybody hit it. You don't even need the next word. Right? You just carry a sign that says, and. You know? And that's enough. I mean, the yippee thing, the symbol is why. That's great. You say to Democrats, you say, why, man, why, why? Join the why, you know, <laughs> why? Join the why, right, bring your sneakers, bring your helmet, right, bring your thing, whatever you got. You know, why, why do you say to Democrats, why, baby? That's a why, that's not a V, it's a why. You can do a whole lot of shit. Steal it. Steal a V. It's a why. And it's up the revolution like that, you know. <laughs> Sock it right to them. They won't put, you don't want it on TV, you write the word fuck on your head. See, and you talk to them forever. <laughs> and look, that won't get on TV, right? <laughs> I mean, I mean that's where theater is at. It's TV. I mean, our thing's for TV. Fuck a mope, they want to get on Meet the Press, you know? We don't want to get that. What's that shit? We want Ed Sullivan, Johnny Carson show. We want the shit where, where people are looking and digging it. Oh, we've had fucking... Uh, they talk about reaching the troops in Vietnam, so they're writing National Guardian. You know, that's groovy.